What a day, what a day, what a day it has been. What's up, what's up everybody? Today we're going to talk about a few of the events going on. We're going to talk about the SWC Championships, which is like basically now. And we're going to talk about some new toys you may get summoned. I mean, some new toys you may get summoned. Uh, let's get it started. Okay, Energy Dash event. Uh, basically what it is, is do all of your daily missions. Use a bunch of energy on either Scenario or d Giants, Dragons, whatever. Um... And then you get the rewards, uh, 800 energy, 800,000 mana, you get 8 scrolls, you get 2 summoning stone. well you get summoning stones enough for 2. Uh, you get what else, 3 star rainbow mon, 4 star rainbow mon, 300 crystals, and 50 ancient coins. Which is all in one reappraisal, but it's only one, right? 50 ancient coins. I think for coming up in the future we're going to see more ancient coins being given out now that everyone has El Sharion. I think we're going to see some more ancient coins being more generous in these uh, upcoming events. But I don't really like these uh, daily mission events because I have so many accounts that I'm like, okay, I'm not doing all of those daily missions every day on six. Like, it's just too hard to keep track of. I know it's fast, but it's just a lot to keep track of on six accounts in addition to doing everything else. What else do we have? Um, we also have the World Finals. By the way, guys, this is, uh, I think this is Midnight. Oh my goodness. Uh, I think this, oh, it's a, it's 11 p.m. It's 11 p.m. 8 p.m. Pacific. So 11 p.m. for me. Right after Saturday morning. So, so maybe we might stream, I don't know. No, it's, I was going to say maybe we might stream the uh, SWC finals. But that's going to be, we're going to be streaming until 6 o'clock in the morning. Because it's Korea time, right? It's this whole big event. It's on Korea time. So it's like, for me, it's almost midnight to do it. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna see all these live stream viewers. So you basically you get crystals, you get light dark. I don't know if it's pieces or it's full scrolls. We'll see. And energy, who cares? Um, unless it's full like dark scrolls, then maybe people care, but I don't know. Uh, rewards for reaching 30,000, 50,000, 100,000 live stream viewers. So 30,000, you get a super angel mom, which is not bad. I'm sure it will reach uh, that. 50,000 legendary rune could be good, could be poop. 100,000 devil mon, great. Excited about the devil mon. Are we really going to reach 100,000 viewers really come to us? Um, here's the thing. That we've never had events that came close to reaching 100,000 viewers. And that's even with being hosted by... I mean, you see some of these other like huge competitions for games that are bigger than Summoner's War and they're not even hitting those numbers. So, 100,000 viewers. How... Where where do you think that they're going to come from, the 100,000 viewers come to us? That's not a realistic number. Um, and... And the thing is, like, the other events before, like, they've been hosted by some of the biggest League of Legends streamers and some of the other uh, big game streamers as well. But a lot of those, if you are, if you ever watch Twitch, also, I don't know if they're counting, because I'm sure it's going to be streamed on another, uh, other sites in different countries. So I'm not sure if they're including all the other sites in different countries. Maybe, I think Panda TV is the, the streaming site for China. Uh, so maybe they have th that, maybe they're streaming on that too. I'm not sure what other streaming platforms. So maybe all of those included could hit 100,000. I'm just used to seeing the numbers from, uh, from the, I guess, American and European sides of things. I'm not really used to seeing the numbers from Asia, from China, from Korea. Maybe all of those combined, everyone could reach 100,000. I'm not entirely possible. I'm not entirely sure, but I just know that a lot of times, like, there have been hosts from big name streamers. If you see, if you ever watch on Twitch, um, if you ever see like one of the events, one of the Summoner's War events, and you watch and you're like, oh, the views popped up by 10,000. They, it's it's a paid host. Like sometimes they pay uh, big name. I don't think they even did that this, like in the past, like uh, for the past few events in 2018. I don't think they really ho paid for hosts, have they? Or I, I, I don't know. I, what? They may have, they may not have, but I know when they first did, like, when they did the Mobile Masters and when they did the 2017, um, finals, they had paid hosts from other big, big streamers, so, I don't know if we're even gonna hit 100,000, I don't know if they're gonna fudge the numbers, they're gonna make, between all of the things, cause streaming services combined, we hit 100,000, hooray, like, I don't know, we might, cause I feel like they did that the first time, they're like, we hit X amount of viewers, and we're like, did you really though? Like, how, where are these viewers coming from? Because I see the chat, I don't feel like that's really the viewers. But anyway, I don't care, as long as we get the mods, right? So, they want people to tune in, they want people to get excited about the RTA. Come to us, here's an idea, if you want to get, to pe get people excited about RTA, make it more accessible to play for 
early to mid game players or mid game players that don't have every single OP unit in the game. Because every, I feel like every season is just more and more. This is only for top tier pay to win players, and this is less and less accessible for most of the community. And I think most of the community gets upset about that, and they're like, "Why do I want to watch something that I will never be able to compete in? That's really not." Anyway, a balanced esport event. I'm I'm just going by what I see from you guys, uh, how I see you guys reacting to it. But anyway, uh, yeah, it's gonna be super so 11 p.m. my time. Okay, uh, 8 p.m. if you're on the uh, West Coast, and I there's a lot of different time zones. I don't know. You, what you pay attention to what it says. I think if you click on the icon, it'll tell you the countdown or whatever. Anyway, uh, new toys. New toys. Soha, a new toy. No, just kidding. Uh, I actually have to reroute my Soha. I had her for... The the way I want to do her now is, is totally different. Okay, so new toy number one. New toy... No, this was not... Uh, I got another new toy today. But this is from... I didn't even do a video. I was going to do a video on him and I, some, I don't publish a lot of videos. But anyway, new toy. Fire Beast Monk. Actually pretty excited about getting him. Pretty excited about getting him. I think I'm going to use him for... He's basically going to be for Siege. Right? That's what I'm going to use him for. So, Siege Offense, Siege Defense. He's going to be for Siege. Maybe I'll take him into some Yen Hongs. Get, the, get that heal block. Haha, <laughs> Yen Hong, you can't heal. Oh, 14 extra turns? Never mind. Maybe I won't take him into some Yen Hongs. But uh, I think he's going to be... Uh, basically, all I feel like I'm going to use him for is Siege. But... Still a fun Siege unit, right? Uh, could use him for, could use him for arena defense and stuff like that, but to be honest, I am super ridiculous Jubago pay to win, and I have better, uh, more, more relevant in nowadays meta units for, uh, arena defense. He was, he used to be great back in the day. They didn't give it to me back in the day, but, uh, anyway. This is, this is the one from today. I don't need to, uh, record this, right? Why would I need to record this? I don't need to record. I'm not going to get anything. Oh, 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 oh. Tricked you come to us. Tricked you come to us. Tricked you come to us. Oh, that's how you do it, baby. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Yeah. Yeah, you literally... I know you're watching, come to us. I know you're watching. That's why I had it recording on the desk. You sneaky. I'm sneakier, baby. I'm sneakier. I'm sneakier, come to us. Oh my god, I wish that was a light dark. Good old Fire Paladin. Talking about top tier, relevant, fire tanks. Fire Paladin. <laughs> I can't say that with a straight face. Is she, she, okay, she's locked. We can only awaken, we can awaken both. And also, a third one that I don't think I mentioned before. Uh, but yeah, I got her, like, a couple weeks ago, too. And I was actually really excited. Like, as you see, she's the one, she's the, she's got runes on her. They're not, she's a work in progress. But, um, she gives me, but she's the one I'm most excited about. Net fives and a light knock four star. You're more excited about the four star. Okay. Um, yeah, I have a team in mind that I think is going to be super cool to use her with. Pretty excited. Pretty excited to use her. Um, and also... Oh yeah, and then let's, uh, and then we got this, uh, I gotta, I, man, everything needs, uh, everything needs violent runes, though. Everything needs violent runes. Let's awaken this guy. But, I'm, I'm, I'm mostly excited to use them for, I guess, Siege. Siege more than any, oh, you know what I liked? I liked you better before, Kumar. You're not as pretty now. But I use them on my alts, I really like them on my alts, but I don't have his OP stuff on my alts, so. Uh, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. I like their unawakened forms, though. Their awakened forms aren't as cool as their their. Uh... I like you less now, cause I see your true potential, and you're still a fire paladin. I could be worse. She could be Daphnis. Wait, which is worse though? <laughs> which is... I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I could actually. I might use her with uh, Immensity and Bulldozer, cause take a look at this. Uh, this is a great leader skill. I could get down with this leader skill. I might use her, or I might use her with chilling. Ooh, I might use her with chilling and something else. But the only thing is I probably won't use her too much now because I don't have Devilmons, right? There's no Devilmons. Maybe if a million people uh, watch the event, then we have the Devilmons. But anyway, guys, uh, super fun. Expect some fun video... <laughs> 
fun. Expect some video. I don't know if they're gonna be fun, but expect some videos coming up with those things. Uh, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, again, stay tuned for. I made sure, I'm sure the. Uh, I'm sure the SWC 2018 is gonna be a fun event, but uh, check that out, and I will maybe give my comments on it afterwards. I hope that some. It'll be fun. Whatever. It'll be. I'm sure it'll be a good event. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, that's it for this one. Stay tuned. Saturday morning summons. Remember, we film it on Fridays. Saturday morning summons. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Bagelmon uh, if you want to tune in for that. And then I will see you as always. That's it. I will see you as always in the next one.